cows are, I recommend going all the way to the back wall rather than trying to chip one off in the front. And look for the cows that have their heads up, not the ones that have their heads down. Usually they'll work better. when they start going around, he can't be backwards and forwards at the same time. And then when she gets them out about halfway, do I need to pull back? Uh-huh. Stay and all these cattle up for him, it makes it really tough. But if he's gotten into that group, well, then he's got to hold the gap for him. So you kind of got to watch what he's doing. And uh, you, you can't depend on it because sometimes they don't look one way and cut another. <laughs> so. and then try to get in sync with them. That looks like a good cow for you right there out in front with the star on his head. And you kind of go out there. Now, stay opposite him. Keep going forward. That's time. Just concentrate on that one. There you go. There you go. Don't get behind me because we're not roping, we're cutting. Just like working a flag. Good job, nice. Okay, good. And you don't try to get closer and closer to him, you just try to stay opposite. Go, there you go. And good job, Bree. Good job, very nice. Good job, Bree. catch up with me. So you're opposite? Good. Okay, Patty, just step toward the cow. Stay opposite. See, you stood there. You took one step while the cow took three. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Out of the road. See how that, that herd holder stepped forward there and go, go, go. kind of discouraged Push that cow? That was That's time. it. Wait, wait. And you just have to turn a little extra. Good. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job, Bree. 